Having a round under par is always a good thing, but looking good and having a round under par is even better. That's why Steve Gotti's Pro Shop is your one-stop shop for that perfect look to make you look like you're part of the PGA Tour. Find the latest in Nike, Puma, Callaway, and K-State and Kansas apparel. And if your mechanics need a little tweaking, give Steve a call for your lesson. Steve Gotti's Pro Shop, 620-792-4306, located at the Club at Stone Ridge, Great Bend. Hello folks, today we're here to teach a little golf. My name is Steve Gotchi. I'm former touring professional, now the head pro at Stone Ridge Golf Club here in Great Bend, Kansas. We're gonna learn a little about chipping today. Most of the amateurs that I know really struggle in this area when we get around the green. We're kinda, we just don't know what to do or how to get the ball close to the holes. So today I have a nine iron and a sand wedge. We'll start with the nine iron, I'll give you some preliminaries on how to get set up and get that shot close to the hole, okay? A lot of you find yourself with the ball just off the green. You know, in a lot of instances, you could putt this ball, which might be the safest venue, but a lot of times there are some irregularities in the grass where we need to chip the ball on the green and get it close to the hole. Okay, so when you're set up, what you want to do, and you, by the way, you can use a seven iron, eight iron, it really doesn't matter, get used to something you like. I have a nine iron for this shot we have at hand. We want to get our feet close together, narrow, because we're not hitting the ball very hard. We want to choke down on the grip so we're not using the full length of the club. As far as setup, we want the ball in the back of our stance, okay, and we want to keep our wrist silent, so we don't want any of this. It's more like a putting stroke. So it's just short and sweet. We get set up, pitch the ball, notice the short follow through to get it close to the hole. We don't need a great big swing. What I see a lot with the AMs is a big swing, decel, bad shot. So hopefully this helps you with your game on the chipping part of it. I also have with me a more lofted club for those of you at home. 60 degree wedge has quite a bit more loft than a nine iron. What this will enable me to do is hit the ball a little higher. Okay, so for this shot, we may be back a little further where we have to create a little more loft to get the ball on the green, okay? Basically the same setup. Notice the narrow stance. Notice I've choked down also. But on this shot, we're gonna use a little more wrist because we have to create, create a little more elevation to the shot, okay? So demonstrated, notice where the ball is positioned. A little more wrist. And we follow through a little further to get, because we have more loft on the club, we have to hit it a little harder. A little more difficult shot for those of you at home, but try it. If you have trouble with this party game, contact your local PGA professional. The people who care are at Grove Chiropractic and Sports Injury. They specialize in all joint pain and sports injuries. If you're suffering from headaches, neck pain, or lower back pain, make an appointment with Grove Chiropractic and Sports Medicine. Dr. Jesse Grove will work with you on a program that's just right for you. Let him relieve your pain and allow you to return to your normal routine. And see Dr. Grove if you're in need of acupuncture treatment. They're accepting new patients at Grove Chiropractic and Sports Injury at 1309 Williams in Great Bend. <laughs> 